that made that one quick. Mm -hmm. And briefly, while we were on break, I discussed with Jim, it seems that one of the things that we have taken for granted and maybe some of us didn't even know about, it was an enlighten me, enlightenment to me tonight to see the process of the delegation to the conference. And in talking about a rep, quite honestly, um, Jim knows his way around Concord and knows his way around the meetings. He is a selectman and I would ask that perhaps with discussion with the Board of Selectmen, especially since you overlap on this committee, that it might be prudent to have you be the appointed member for um, the voting delegate to the conference. It may serve us all. Um, that's just a thought. We have no say in that. It goes to the selectmen. But in no way, shape, or form should we not have someone representing us at that conference mm -hmm. with the vote. I so. agree. We should not have no one representing us. But if we're going to make individual recommendations, I would suggest that Chairman Bean is the one, apparently, that makes the decision. And he might want to consider me for that position. Okay. Mo <laughs> moving on, I'll trust Jim. You'll open the discussion <laughs> on it. Okay, thank you. That's all I'm asking you. Open the discussion. Um, and moving on from that. <laughs> And I know there's not a meeting next week because there was a meeting this week, so yep. the next meeting is July 1st. Yes. Could you open the discussion on that July 1st? Yep. Because it probably won't be resolved just before the conference. All right. 